Yo, Quant QNT holders, right now the Quant QNT price is moving in the daily time frame. Something really massive could potentially be happening right now behind the scenes, and many of us are not aware of this. So today we're talking about the recent Quant QNT price action, and we will discuss what we could expect next for the Quant QNT price. So without wasting any more of your time, smash like, smash subscribe. And let's begin this video. Yo, what is going on, Quant QNT holders? Right now, something insane is going on with the Quant QNT price. If you take a look at the charts right now in the daily time frame for the Quant QNT price, for the past few days, we have bumped significantly towards the upside in a sharp manner. That's about a 33% bump towards the upside right after touching this key level right here. What is this key level? that has led to this crazy pump for the quant QNT price. Why have we bounced significantly towards the upside from this level? What is this level? Well, let's talk about this. Let's talk about the recent price action. Let's talk about what we can expect next. So right now, the quant QNT price is pumping and we're moving. We're moving towards the upside in the daily time frame and in the long term. This is looking a little crazy because this level, this red zone, is an order block. For your information, an order block is a key level where price reacts significantly. As you guys can see in history, the price had green candles, one, two, three, four, five. But yeah, these green candles were interrupted by one red candle, which makes this a weekly time frame order block. And usually, when the price retests an order block, once again, it usually reacts strongly towards that level. As an example right here, we have come down significantly, but we found support at this order block. Therefore, order blocks are important levels to look out for, and right now we're bouncing. So what can we expect from here for the Quant QNT price? Because I know that most of you Quant QNT holders are not having this price action anymore. I'm, I'm sure that most of you Quant QNT holders are very, very annoyed, are frustrated with the price action, well, let me try to give you a bit of a hopium right here. So yeah, if you do see Quant QNT successfully hold this level, which right now it looks like we are, well, in the next couple of weeks or months, we could expect great price action for Quant QNT. And potentially, we could move back up to these levels over here in the next couple of months. Because again, this is a key level. This is an order block, and therefore, I'm expecting the bulls to at least try to take over and hold the, the hold the line because if we do lose this level that could be dangerous i have said this in my previous video if we do see quant q and t lose this level right here we could dump even lower towards the bear market lows right over here the previous bear market swing low or the bear market low right here that is at around $50. So if you don't want to see Quant QNT dump to $50, we must see Quant QNT hold this level at all costs and we must see an immediate recovery right here, right now. But if let's now talk about my long term view, all right? Let's talk about what I'm expecting for Quant QNT in the long term. So yeah, right now the price action for Quant QNT looks very, very messy to be honest with you. For the for what for the past two years, the price action hasn't been doing anything. We have been moving sideways for two years, and then we dump towards the downside. This is looking terrible. I'm not gonna lie to your face right now. If I were to be completely honest with you, this price action looks bad, it looks terrible, it looks messy. But there is still a chance, there is still a chance we could recover right here. As long as we hold this order block, there's a chance we could see a, a nice recovery back to these levels. And then eventually, once the bull market actually strikes, we could see Quant QNT rally towards the upside. All right. But again, like I've said in my in my previous videos, I in this channel heavily preach for portfolio diversification because again, there there is a chance that Quant QNT could also just do this the entire bull cycle and not do anything. Just like XRP, XRP hasn't done anything in the last cycle. XRP has not surpassed its previous all-time high. And there is a chance that that could happen to Quant QNT. Just so, so that's why I'm, I'm warning you that I, I heavily preach for diversification in this channel. It's, it's best to diversify, to minimize risk, and to avoid you know heavy losses. 
But if you are a heavy believer on quant QNT, then that's on you. If you want to go all in quant QNT, that's your choice. That's on you. But personally, I don't hold any quant QNT right now. However, if I do see quant QNT start, start to recover, I might hop back in. That's my game plan, and I'm sticking to my game plan. But again, that's the video. Subscribe, like, and uh, join my Telegram group. It's a new group. The link is in the description. And also join my Discord server. Um, yeah.